What is up guys, the Platform Gamer here, and I have an exciting video uh, to show you. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get PS4 Remote Play working in 2018, but uh, disclaimer, it does cost around $4, but it's totally worth it. Like, it's just amazing. It's an amazing app. The developer is amazing. Uh, he updates it constantly. Uh, making improvements, stay, stay, making it stable, all this stuff. It's just an amazing app, and that's what I use now to record my PS4 gameplay. So I could, you know, have it on my Android phone, uh, my Note 9, and I could actually just edit it and do all this stuff on my phone rather than on my computer, which I don't know anything about editing on there. Only on my phone I do. So, but anyways. I'm getting off topic. Uh, okay, so it costs four dollars just to let you guys know. But let's go ahead and get started with this video. All right, guys. So the first thing you're gonna need to do is head over onto the Google Play Store, and you're gonna wanna search PS Joy. It's gonna be the first one by F Florian Grill. Just go ahead. Uh, sorry for the background noise. Go ahead. It's uh unreleased version. As you can tell, he updated it today. Um, and you just install it. Once you install it, well, click on the read more. And you're going to need to download the PS uh, Joy server. As you can tell, you go into here, his website, or GitHub. Then all you got to do is um, click download. Right here, PS Joy server right here. Uh, as you can tell, now it's downloading, but I don't know why I downloaded it. After you download it, go ahead and go to the setup process. And uh, he describes everything that you need to know in this. So make sure you go to the description on the Play Store after you buy it. And they have videos to show you, so that's why I, I'm telling you this is because I'm not gonna be able to make a video like, oh, okay, let's go ahead and over in my computer so I can show you this. Uh, he will, you could contact the developer, he'll, he will respond uh, within like a couple hours, and you can ask him any questions you want. Um, it's just pretty, pretty awesome. And as you can tell, I did the review, I love it. Which I really do. So, anyways, guys, uh, let me actually take it to the app. Here it is, right here. It'll search for a um, connection from my PC, but I don't have my PC on right now. The TP even gets it. Yeah, see. So, as you can tell, there's connect, there's customize, there's, you can use it as a gamepad. You can connect your DualShock 4 to your phone. And play like that. There's a remote right there. Let's go to settings. As you can tell, these are all the settings in the in the application. Remote don't drop frames. There's auto for your headphones. It's just an amazing application, guys. I just wanted to bring you this video to show you that this app is out there and you can actually stream ps4 games to your android device so guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up i'll really appreciate it and i'll see you guys in the next video peace